Hey, welcome to my play... not playthrough, why? Why almost said playthrough? Welcome to my live stream for making this Pikami Adobe character animator puppet. So yeah, um, I was doing the legs. I was gonna finish this leg. Actually, I think I was gonna finish both legs because I had like maybe 20 minutes left in my previous stream of this. But like the internet died, so... That's why it's like incomplete. Yeah. Uh, next, I have to make the arm. Maybe I need to make this bigger. I don't know. We'll see. Well, it's gonna be difficult for the arm to put it there. Ah, uh, now I'm just like thinking about it. Like when when the arm moves around, it's going to conflict with so many other layers. Basically, she can't. Her arm can't go higher than this like her elbows can go straight like this but if she tries to put her arms above her shoulders then we're gonna have issues <laughs> that's that's how it is with all adobe character animator puppets unless like you have a really simple model and how are you doing will yeah i'm doing well um i'm really tired because you know like jim and uh gym and then i went swimming in the pool and then i cooked food rather than ordering out and i didn't take a nap so i don't know i i feel tired and not tired at the same time so very odd but anyway how you doing is it my existence is my existence for the past few months is just like feeling tired but can't sleep uh but anyway Enough of my problems. How, how are you? It's funny at work uh, a while back they had this policy of like if someone asks you how are you you can't just say one word response fine. I remember when they talked to me I'm like fine good or like uh, can't complain or whatever. <laughs> Meanwhile here I am on stream like <laughs> Uh, basically telling, uh, it's like every day I tell my life story or something like that. <laughs> Doing good, but my knee is fucky. Wow, what happened to your knee? Like, uh, just like accident or sport accident or, or what? Or just bad luck? Oh yeah, I was watching Bochi the Rock today. I was like kind of um i was worried that uh i shouldn't start an anime because then i won't get any work done but today i i, I planned I, I was like you know what i'm i'm tired i'm gonna take a break today so i didn't uh i didn't uh i didn't do my video project uh probably i have m oh wait i didn't yeah i didn't do my video project but i will uh I started watching Bocce the Rock. I was like saying, huh, should I watch Kill la Kill since I have the PS4 now? And I have it plugged in the living room so I could watch there or gonna watch Bocce the Rock. So when I watch Bocce the Rock. Imagine burying out your life story in someone types K. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I slept on it wrong. Oh, so is it just like um what do you call that again it's numb you know it has that w feeling I, I the best way that the people have described the feeling is like they show uh tv static and i feel like yeah that is very accurate so is that uh what's going on or is it something else or is it like like i felt like your muscle it hurts or something Okay, how oops how does this look like i got a bad position and it uh somehow end up like behind my thigh oh okay okay 
Yes, yeah, sorry if I'm not uh, responding that uh, promptly because I, I, I'm, I'm going to kind of concentrating on this right now because if I don't do the thing I'm doing, I'll forget it later. Uh, let me just do this and then I'll take a peek at the chat. Oh, hey, Frontive. You're wrong, Jammer. It's common sense and human morality. What? Common sense and human morality? I slept lying flat. Maybe it was the heat. Oh, hi, Front. What? What do you mean I'm wrong, human? Huh? What am I wrong? What? <laughs> what What did I say to prompt a, a response like that? What? Common sense to talk more if someone asks. Oh, that? Is that what you mean? I guess. It's just that the response is so... I don't know. It's like a minute or two after the fact. So I'm like, huh? What the f... Hi, Will. I do not know, Will. Say one word response. Oh, yeah. I, I guess that's it. But again, like I said, it's... It's so divorced from what I said. Because that was like a few minutes ago. I'm like, what did I say? Oh, you're just saying random stuff. Uh, yeah, how you doing? You made Jammer confused. Oh, well, it's not hard to do. Just friggin... Uh, just friggin... You want to see me confused? Just watch me play... Um, oh, what's that game called again? Siberia. Or one of the puzzles in... Uh, in... <laughs> what's that game called again? Um, what's that game called again? It... Um... Dang. Uh, what's that? The oh yeah, Ed, Edna and Harvey. Yeah, just one of those puzzles, and then ta-da. I'm confused. Oh, that looks terrible. Sorry if I'm not talking. I'm trying to concentrate on these lines. I mean, I, I mean, I am talking, uh, but sorry if I'm not engaging the chat because I see, I see the chat flying. I mean, not flying, but you know, moving and stuff. Oh, that does not look good. Ah, dang it. Okay, let's redo that. Okay. Yeah, because it's random. Uh, all is well. Whoops, Superland. Oh, Edna and Harvey. <laughs> what about... Oh, was there parts in Superland that I got confused? I guess? Like some parts were like, oh, what, what ability do I need to use here again? I guess that. But yeah. Yeah, are you saying you got a topic? Uh, I s you got a topic? Um, okay, I guess. Like, go ahead, shoot. Let me hear the topic. Okay. No, that's not good. Okay, um, you solve them easily later on. The electricity puzzles and such. We have been monitoring your behavior pattern since 2012. We have been monitoring to ensure safety. We want you to be aware of our presence. Expect visit from us very soon. And when FBI, open up! Uh, like, oh, it's like one of those, eh? <laughs> Let me do this. Here, let me smooth that out. Not that much. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, um... 
one of my video submissions to that um QT tourney. I guess I could show it. Mostly to do with the rise of AI I mean uh voice memes. They have one character, Joshua Graham. Oh yeah, I've I've seen it in my recommendations, but I haven't watched it. There's like stuff like Joshua Graham reads the Bible. But I've mostly seen the what's that? The dog dogger ma or what's his name again? From uh from Morrowind. New Vegas apparently, yeah. Remember in New Vegas, he's the one that they kept. Uh, they, he's the burned man. Remember, uh, they cop. They kept talking about the burned man at the um, as Kaiser's Legion. That's Joshua Graham, but he didn't show up in that in the in when I played because he's in the DLC. It's the Malpays Legate. Okay. You need to you need his context to fully appreciate, but it's good either way. Um, what do you call it? Oh yeah, yeah. Let me let me show you the the thing. My short was uh, it, it premiered today at the QT tourney. So let me just get to it. No. no. Uh, okay, here it is. Oh, full screen. So it was. Okay, that's fine. So here it is. Why is the volume so high that it, <laughs> it peaked? It peaked my audio. Hey, bro, can I get a sip of that water? It's not water. Oh, it's it's after this one. It's vinegar. What? It's vinegar, pussy. Okay, come on, it's this next one. Oh wait, no, not this. Okay, the one after this. Okay. Get out of my head. Get out of my head. A video that pits Miss House versus Joshua in the debate. Yeah. Come on. What's the matter? Okay, it's after this. No, it's definitely after this one. Oh wait, I should show the comments. Um why why is it not showing? Where where are the comments? Okay, ah, here we go, here we go. Come on, show the comments. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, okay, this next one is my video. Why is Tian a horse? Tian Ho, why are you a horse? You know, you're asking kind of rude questions at the moment, and I do not appreciate that. I kind of find it rude. You just don't ask people why are they horses. Do I even ask why your mom is a fucking pig? I don't. So why are you asking why am I a horse? What did I do to you? The fuck's your issue? The fuck's your issue? Why the heck is it so... Why is, why is it peaking my audio? <laughs> Oh, yeah, let's look at the uh let let's look at the comments here that go by. It's funny that they that they had my short at the end. It was the last short. But yeah, uh there's the comments. But yeah, like there's a whole bunch of these shorts that they put during the break. And they're pretty hilarious. Like like one of them has like a musical number and stuff in it. And it's like, wow, like, look at the speed, the speed draw and stuff. And like, um, it, 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 w watching other people make these shorts and stuff, it's, it, it kind of makes me like, oh, I guess my animation and stuff is good, but my, my stuff like video production or joke writing or like audio and like like some of them they they write songs and they sing it and like oh i can never do that stuff this shows like the weakness in my media skills oh hey sir violet you flash grenade theme what's the flash grenade theme anywho yeah um if you're interested in those other shorts i, I suggest going to their QT tourney on uh on uh uh Twitch. But yeah, oh, oh, oh wow. You showed up, Sir Violet. It's cool that you saw that I get light theme. <laughs> oh, light theme. Um I don't know. Well, yeah, what's it you're saying, John Joshua? What 
you have the character Joshua Graham, you Vegas. Joshua Graham is sexy. Joshua is mild paced, legate. You need his context fully. I'm doing Legion run on New Vegas right now. Ah, that's cool. What the fuck? Stop watching me. There's a video that pits Mr. House versus Joshua in a debate. Who's watching? What are they debating about? Like, there's hilarious ones where, like, the, you know, the presidents, they're debating which, which is their favorite, uh, like, Hollow Live uh, member or something. Uh, who are you watching? All of you, get out of my head. Get out of my head. We reach the end, and Jammer is still saying that it's after this one. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, you okay, front type? Hello, new flash grenade. What's the new flash grenade theme? I should look that up. Stop being insecure, Whammer. Light theme now. Well, Jammer, it's okay. You just need to focus on what you got. Yeah, insecurity is cringe. Yeah. Light mode <laughs> user cringe. You need to focus on not using light mode. Oh, you mean in my browser? Or in Twitch? You mean like my Twitch is not in light mode? Uh, dark mode? Well, I barely use Twitch, so I don't like change the settings. So this is on friggin' default settings. So like, I barely use Twitch. So yeah, I don't. So that's why it's on light mode. It's kind of serious one. Search it if you want. Uh, if you want to see. Uh, okay, I guess. Uh, which one? The Joshua Graham one. And house. You know. It, it, you know, if, if someone does a t uh, an AI voice for all the TFH characters, I'm going to be, like, so happy. Like, maybe I should, like, uh, pay... Maybe I should actually do that. Like, pay for the service. And then I I will have the AI voices and I could make them say anything I want. Ha 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 ha. Oh, wait, no. Don't do that. And then I could just keep, like, I could make my own TFH um, TV show. And then I could just recreate, uh, you know, I'll, I, I could, I could, I could put the, the voice lines from story mode. And then I could just make the AI say the story, uh, the, the lines. And then I could just animate it. And then like, look, <laughs> ah, it's the TFH TV show made by Rich Jammer, just some weirdo guy. <laughs> On his own, <laughs> making the whole thing. It's about Mojave as a whole. Ah, okay. Versus House, yes. I don't think they have enough voice lines for that. Recreate the vines. Um. The, the thing is, with, uh, with that, I would have to find the other voice actors' work. And hopefully their voice sounds similar. Like... Tara Strong has obviously a ton of uh, of voice work, but I don't she think she's ever done a Texan character, so it's going to be very difficult to uh, to do to uh, get for her because you know she's never done a Texan character. She's done a character with an Asian uh, accent, so if it'd be funny if I just had. Had uh, Tara Strong like voice Tian Ho, like, oh, you're voicing the Asian character. Okay. <laughs> Imagine if she did that nowadays, she'd be called a racist or something. <laughs> when the narrator says, Texas wins, love giving NCR troopers bl bl blunt force trauma with metal pipes. That line was not voice. Which one? Texas wins? Okay, Front Dive is role playing his character in New Vegas. Yeah, he's role-playing it in the chat. Yeah, what was I saying? Like, <laughs> imagine like, oh, I'll just make make the TV show myself. Like, I always see people in the chat or something like saying, oh, TFA should make a TV show and be hilarious. If I was like, I'll do it myself. I'd be like all Thanos and I'll do it myself. But yeah, with like AI, imagine like Im with AI, I could I could actually do it. I could do it myself. <laughs> I mean, it's not gonna be like like a friggin' like actual TV show, but it'll be good enough, I guess. 
They just patched together her audio so Texas can be you know, out, really. I mean, maybe... Really? Did they really do that? Because I thought, like, they had plans to make Texas from, like, a long time ago. So, I guess when they had her in the studio, they said, like, Oh, can you voice uh, Texas and uh, uh, these other DLC characters and whatnot? DIY cartoon, yeah, exactly. Yes, Jam, sorry, there has been a push to match the ethnicity of the character. Yeah, that, that's what sucks nowadays, that um, they do that. They match the ethnicity to the character. I mean, like, when I said, like, uh, oh, they, they'd cancel Tara Strong for that nowadays, but I mean, that's something I don't want to happen. But yeah, it just, it kind of sucks. But anywho, like imagine like Samurai Jack. He he's he's voiced like a bl uh, by a black guy, and then Kratos from God of War, he's been voiced by a black uh guy twice. I mean, is is saying a uh, black uh, politically correct, or should I say African American? I don't know nowadays. You are, it's not a bad thing, but the hate of playing a character not of your race is the feel when you guys are talking. The fuck am I? What the fuck are we talking about? I don't know. What are, what are we talking about? Some stupid nonsense. I, I think this one should be 1.75. This one out here should be thick, and then that one should be thin. What are we talking about, Will? <laughs> anyway, like I like I keep saying, I don't I don't like talking about politics. So what what, what am I doing? Oh, I'm talking about politics. Stop! Stop! Cancel culture is just a nicer way of saying ostracization. Yeah. Like I said, ah, don't talk politics. Shut up! Shut up, Rich Jammer. You're breaking your own rules. I mean, look at the, well, just doing this stream right now, I guess, might be a little bit uh, political because friggin' Pika Me was friggin', you know, harassed for political reasons. So me just doing this already is already breaking my own rules. No idea politics in Hollywood and how Tara Strong probs. Won't be able to play another race ever again, perhaps. I, I don't know. Oh, um, hmm. didn't she do the voice for Omi? Uh, in a re recently, pretty recently, right? Did she do it for that Warner Brothers? Uh, for that multiverses? Did they have Shaolin Showdown characters in that? When I move a line, it messes everything up. This is so annoying. Yeah, Jammer hates trying <laughs> What? No! Duh! That was recorded on the stream! Uh, you will you will be the death of me, Will. Anyway. Who is that? Pika me, a Twitch streamer? Um she's she streamed on Twitch uh, a bunch of times. Which annoys me because on on Twitch she she, tw uh, she streams in English, but everywhere else she's uh, like in YouTube where I follow her she streams in uh, Japanese. So I'm like, why? Yeah, you don't know this peek of me. Uh, I guess you're not that. Uh, well, I guess you're not that into VTuber, so you don't know who she is. Didn't she get shit on for wanting to play Hogwarts Legacy? Yes, yes she did. Yes she did. <laughs> Anyone that supports people who play this game hate the specific group. Yeah. Um, what was I doing again? You know what? Let's, shh. Ooh, let's change the topic. Shh. <laughs> Is this supposed to be like this? Oh, that's gonna look odd when, when I put the, the shirt there. Uh, 
How is that gonna look? I just remembered, like, when I put the arm here, this, this part here is gonna be there forever. So it's gonna look odd. So... What do I do there? Torso, torso, torso. I think I need to just delete this line here. Bye-bye. And I need to get rid of this. And then... Uh, move the line up here. There we go. Uh, hopefully that will be fine. <laughs> Total... What? What I say? Uh, oh, the controversy around Hogwarts Legacy sucks. So dumb thought path. It doesn't make sense. Quite on set. How did we get here from voice AI meme? How did we get here from a voice AI meme? Uh, oh, uh... We, we got here from voice AI meme because I was talking about uh, voice AI like um, I would uh, take I would take like other actors performances on other TV shows or properties and then use it in uh, use it to try to you know make make a thing and I said like oh could use um, um, Tara Strong and when I was like, oh, Tara Strong, she's done, like, the voice of Omi, like, an Asian character. And I was saying, like, oh, nowadays you can't do that because, you know. Uh, yeah, that's how we got, we got into that. No, oh, this belongs over there. You know what? Let's talk about the uh, Bochi the Rock. You guys watch that show, Bochi the Rock, or do you just watch Ro Dwayne the Rock Johnson instead? <laughs> no, no. Oh, you know what? Let's let's put it. Let's keep it that way. You start from a random what? Jammer speaking on tangents, Wik Wikipedia race. You start from a random wiki page and reach your goal. You're gonna get the Hogwarts Legacy this April. Um, for are you waiting for like um PS4 release or something? Because uh, what do you call it? Yeah, like it's only on PC and on PS and next gen consoles right now, right? Me, um, I'm like, nah, I don't want to, I don't want to get, uh, Hogwarts Legacy. I haven't been interested in Harry Potter since the fourth book, the, um, Goblet of Fire. That's the last book I read. After that, I did watch some of the movies, but I don't know. I was like super bored watching them. I was like, what the fudge? What the fudge? <laughs> I don't understand anything. Like, I was kind of bored, like, watching one of them. It's like, uh, I don't know what's going on. Especially because I didn't watch some of the previous movies. Like, I watched the one where... Uh, I think it was after um, Dumbledore died or something. And then uh, a different um, a different person was the headmaster or, or something. Some lady. And I was like, oh, what's going on? <laughs> And then I watched the last two movies and I'm like, okay, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, PS version comes out at April 10. The movies don't make sense if you haven't read the books. Really? Then, I mean, I, there's a bunch of people who didn't read the books, so... I mean, it's like Jurassic Park. Like, there's a bunch of people who didn't, like, read the books like me. I never read... And, like, The Godfather. And also The Shining... Like I never watched the, uh, I never watched the friggin, I mean I never read the Shining book, but the Shining movie is like one of my favorites. I mean to be fair, it it is pretty different. Uh, Stephen King's uh, thing is quite different from the uh, the movie. 
The movies don't. Uh, Harry Potter cast a le- expecto patronum. A deer appeared, and it says, "I saw my father." The people would say, "Why is this had a deer?" <laughs> Why was that in the book or something? I honestly feel like uh, for books, uh, unless if it's a short book, usually you you want it as like a TV series or something. I'm, oh wait, no, that's not fair because Lord of the Rings, like three books and each movie was a, a separate thing, and not a TV series because usually books are friggin' long. And uh, a lot of it has like, ooh, explaining lore and all that. So, um, so there's a lot of things missed in the books and and all that. But well, I don't understand what I did over there. I honestly think this might need to be out a bit more like this no wrong one i honestly think that should be out a bit more like that uh you're talking about umbridge she she that teacher everyone hates i have no idea like I, again, uh, I was like half paying attention to the movie. Uh, and to be fair, I watched it on TV and not at the cinema, so I'm like, um, so I was like half paying attention to it. So I'm like, well, what's going on? I don't understand the. Oh, sorry, Jammer. I'm back. I forgot to cook extra rice for people coming over. It's fine. What is extra rice? Rice that is more rice than the regular rice. Will, he put extra rice, but he didn't put extra water. So now your guests are going to complain that the rice is too dry. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, you know what? Uh, I think I'll put um, shoelace things separately. Shoelace should have physics on it, I think. Um, I think I'll do that one later since... Oh wait, you know I need to do it now. Because I need to do the, the thing. How do you not know what a bridge is on bridge? <laughs> Lol. They like dry rice weird as <laughs> Instead of fried rice, you're serving up dried rice. <laughs> Didn't. Dried rice. I mean, the the rice that you buy from the store is pretty much dried rice, but I don't know, <laughs> I don't know why I found that so funny. <laughs> dried rice. I know, I know it's not that funny, but I don't know why. I, I just find it so funny. Dried rice. I like my rice soupy and wet. They like stir fry, and you like porridge. Uh, chocolate porridge. Was that the <laughs> champarada, right? Chocolate r uh, rice. Chocolate rice pudding, I guess. It, uh, what the fuck? Yeah, what are we talking, uh, front dive? We're, we're talking weird nonsense, right? He does not understand. Do you understand? Correct, Jammer. Maybe you are turning into a dad. Is your wife pregnant? Uh. Hmm. Well, I don't have a wife, so I don't know who I who I impregnated. 
Just some random lady. <laughs> That's not what I'm cooking. <laughs> Whammer is is she bread bread and then What the gender of the baby? Uh well how how can uh I'm not going to assume the baby's gender so soon. <laughs> <laughs> how dare you? No gender reveal part uh party either. You saw that stuff like that happens like with the, the gender reveal parties that people have? Like what the heck? Like burn down the forest or something. Immaculate conception, yes. That's the thing, like, uh, what do you say, uh, Star Wars Episode 1? Like, oh, there was, there is no father. Like, friggin' Anakin Skywalker is Space Jesus. Oh, yeah, I found out the other day that my brother's girlfriend became uh, a corporate VTuber. So now I'm like, friggin', oh... I know a VTuber, a corporate VTuber. It's from a company I never heard of, so... Uh, I don't... I mean, my brother, they didn't tell me what company she's working at, so I'm like... Um, okay. <laughs> so I, I have no idea if I'll... Like, imagine I encounter her and I'm like, oh... That's, I mean, I, I probably never know that's her. Like, imagine if, uh, if she gets famous and then, uh, I start following her like, Oh, I'm simping for her and without knowing that that is my brother's girlfriend. <laughs> like, uh-oh. There's a theory that succubi were demons made by the church to explain how women get pregnant by priest seed. Wait, I thought succubi, um... Uh, did was the one who preyed on men, and then you know, which which explained uh, what do you call that? Um, what do you call that again when you climax during your sleep, or when you wake up? What do you call that again? Wet dream. Yeah, I thought I thought succubi were was like an explanation for wet dreams or something. Or am I getting that wrong? The way it worked was that female succubi species took the seed of the priest. Oh, okay. And gave it to the male cubus species inserted to the women. Succubi is the male. Oh, incub. Oh, incubi. Like incubus, nocturnal emission. They are, yeah. Okay, I get it. Oh, hi, Tenen. How's it going? I, I just mentioned Jojo's Bizarre Adventure briefly and you show up. <laughs> oh, what a coincidence. They are... Oh, no. Change subject again, XD. How's front dive doing? I don't know. Dang it. Wrong color. Here we go. Hmm. By the way, if you guys are not digging the music and uh, you want to listen to something else, if you could suggest other um, uh, royalty, uh, copyright free music, then go right ahead because. The music is starting to get on my nerves. <laughs> uh, so yeah, but I have to listen to it because you know. How's uh, hi Will? I'm doing okay. So Jammer, lobsters, cockroaches of the sea. Um, they're like um. Yeah, they're like bugs, but uh, they're more like um. What do you call it? Like beetles or something? Cockroaches are like those... What do you call them again? They're like these... 
um, bugs. Like if you go to the the coast or something, uh, is it is it right to coast? Like if you go to the beach or something and you see these little little creatures that uh, crawl around in the rocks, I feel like those are like the roaches of the sea. And lobsters are like the um, what are they? They're like the big ass grasshoppers of the sea or the big ass beetles of the sea. All, all the non copyright music I hear are annoying. I think there are some exceptions like um, Kevin McLeod, but I think Kevin McLeod music is annoying because so many people have used it that, um, like, oh no, this song again, you know. I should probably go download a bunch of the Kevin McLeod stuff so I could use it on my videos and, and whatnot. Oh, this is really annoying <laughs> when I see something like that. I have to unlock all this. I wish there's a thing where where I could specifically pick which one I want to unlock. Uh Sand fleas. Are they so what they're called? Lobster also used to be prison food. Um yeah, I remember back in the day like um like maybe during the depression era or something. Oh no, pre uh, depression era. Like the the boom of the U.S. 1930s and the 20s. So, so what happened is a lot of um, you know like poor people or like you know um, I guess not poor people is the wrong well kind of poor people, but like people lower in the social ladder, they became rich. And uh, that's the thing, like, um, lobsters and all that stuff used to be food for, like, poor people. But then all these, uh, all these uh, people, they became rich during the 20s and 30s and whatnot. So then, but they still ate lobster and stuff. So then it got viewed as fancy food. I think that's the story behind, like, like wh why lobster is so, like, considered fancy and whatnot. Um, so you see prison food and peasant food, yeah. Uh, by the way, have you seen new Persona game? Um, no? Is there a new one? Not a re-race because I'm kind of lagging. Lagging right now? Stream lagging for me. Where yet stream... Stream where you learn how to make music is a good way to spend time. Oh, that'd be cool, but I would like to learn the piano. Um, I think guitar, no, Rock Band 3 has, um, music tutorials for the piano. That would be cool to play. You know what? That would be something cool to, to do on a stream. Like, learn to play the piano with Rock Band 3. That'd be, Persona 5X, is that like golden? Oh wait, no, there's Persona 5 Royale, right? So what's Persona 5X? JKXD. I'm gonna go listen to copyrighted music. I mean, technically, The Sims music is copyrighted music, but EA doesn't claim it, so that's why it's not being struck and whatnot. Lord Jammer said back in the day, like he was there. What did I say back in? Oh, back in the day when I said twenties and forty, thirties. Uh, okay, old Jammer it has a mobile game. Oh, okay, a Jammer doing your ancestors proud. All. Us Asians have to learn the piano at one point in our life. The reason why I want to learn piano is because it's really versatile. You know, like... Um, you can... Like, say, I want 
to play the I want my song to have guitar in it but I only know how to play the piano so I could make the piano simulate guitar noises instead of me learning the guitar so yeah that, that that's like one of the things like I want to learn piano because you know, like again like I said you can make it play anything um what the why aren't you going behind huh what the huh something's going on here so wait what is this thing what is this item here what is this object oh okay don't don't mess with that <gasps> i friggin messed with it okay there we go okay this is what i'm looking for where'd it go okay there it is there we go gotta go for real this time yeah thanks for joining me sir violet Enjoy making fluffy socks. Well, I have one more pair to do, so I'll do that later. But right now, I'm making fluffy shoes. But yeah, uh, that's why I'd like, like, I'd like to learn the piano. Because that's the one thing I'd love. Because I, I don't know. I, I, I really want to make like um, animated music videos. I want to use like my editing skills and and make music videos. Sure, it's gonna be covers of songs and whatnot, but whatever. It'll be it'll be uh it'll be done uh, covered by me to mostly avoid uh the copyright stuff. But yeah, it's one of the things I I I'd love to do. But I'm not as musically inclined. Like, maybe like, because uh, cause the, the thing is, I, I feel like I, I want to compose music more than I want to play instruments. Like, honestly, I would, um, what do you call it? I'd rather like sit on a music program and then um, like, you know how sheet music, right? You have all the lines there and you just write the notes and stuff like Honestly, I would rather, in my mind, I would rather do stuff like, um, like there's the, there's like, there's the music and then I right click and then I put in the note I want and then I could just compose the music there because music program, yeah, music programs. Like, I, I feel like, I feel like I, I'd rather do that. Like, I kind of wish that, um, all the, all the mute, like. Is there a good database where I could find the sheet music of popular songs? Like, obviously, I could find the sheet music for classical music. Maybe I should do that one day. Like, find the sheet music of classical music and um, use a music program and try to recreate it into the music program. And just write it, write it down. I mean, uh, like, you know, compose it into the program. And then, you know, and then doing that process, I'll eventually learn like, oh, this note is this, this note is that. Um, and then I could just like by ear, uh, like, oh, this song, it has this note and that note and that note. And then I could just easily, uh, then I would um, like, I could just listen to a song and then I could just like copy down the notes by memory but not really by memory but by listening to it and like okay this song uses this note uses this chord and that chord and uh and then i could just uh what do you call it? like make remixes of certain songs and whatnot that's 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 a, that's the kind of thing i want to do with music i don't i i honestly don't want to uh playing like instruments is would be cool it's like it's like karaoke you know like except you're doing it with an instrument but yeah that, mm, 
And so maybe they'd be careful if you too liberal in sampling, you could get in trouble. That's true. Dang Jammer improving himself day by day. But yeah, that would be cool. Maybe I should do that one day. And uh, I and that's why I like. Um, I guess the piano would be good because like. Maybe if I could find that pro uh, like a program where I could just compose the music like well obviously instead of writing it down I I uh, I'm in the computer and and then I put the notes down but then I, I guess I should learn piano because it would be faster just to, like like imagine like like because in a piano it's like you're typing out the notes like imagine imagine you're you're on a keyboard right. I mean, imagine you want to write a letter, right? Like, like I want to write words like facts or something. So imagine if I have to do it by mouse. Like, oh, I want to write facts. Like, right click, blah, blah, F, and then right click, blah, blah, A, and then right click, blah, blah, X. Like, that would obviously, t like, be really slow and take a lot of time. But, like, getting a piano would be just like like typing on the keyboard right like it, it'd be like significantly faster but yeah but i'm <laughs> i'm so busy with so much other stuff that stuff like that uh has to wait like maybe eventually it's like well, how many video games am i playing but yeah that that'll be like something cool to stream in the future like um uh oh let, let's learn piano with rock band 3 you know that that'd be cool have you searched persona oh no i have not you're kind of lagging um fine let me look it up now <gasps> i i <gasps> I put I put in the search bar have you searched Persona 5X <laughs> instead of Persona 5X. What is this? Phantom X announced for iOS. Oh. Mobile spin-off. Oh, okay. It's on mobile, so I'm not very interested in that because it's on mobile. So yeah. And I haven't uh, played any of the Persona games yet. Maybe I should play one of them. I got a Persona game over here. Do I actually have it here? No, it's not with me. But there's a Persona 5 game somewhere. On PS4. And now that I got the PS4 back, maybe I could play it. But where is it? I think it's not here. Okay, Final Fantasy 15, Last of Us, Monster Hunter World, Dragon Ball Fighter, Shenmue, Yakuza, Wolfenstein 2, Doom. Oh, I think I gave it back to my bro. Should I play the original version or Royale? Because, um, what do you call it? I heard that there are some changes and some people don't like the changes. How active is TFH meme community right now, Jammer? Um, honestly, the the most active I see is QT Turney. That's like one of the reasons why I did uh, I collabed with them in a video, because I've been looking around like for people that make videos or to help me with videos, or even to a place to post videos, like you know the type of videos I make, and QT Turney. Is honestly like one of the few ones that uh, actively do it, uh, so that's why uh, <laughs> that's why I was like I I, I search them out uh, I I not, not search I seek them out so that um, I can like make some videos for them and whatnot. Bad. I mean there, I'm sure there are some somewhere, but. QT Turney is is the the one I like the most. Like like I said, like they made uh, a bunch of they keep they make a lot of videos and whatnot. I'm sure there is somewhere like um, maybe I'm just not that um, friendly and I, I I haven't found any. 
but yeah maybe maybe there are somewhere and i'm just not uh active enough like for instance twitter maybe on twitter there's active uh, tfh meme community but yeah i don't know And I don't think I, <laughs> uh, I haven't uh, contributed. Probably um, there's only like uh, there's only one meme I've uh, what do you call it? I've contributed to to that I see people post a lot for a TFH like in like in the Discord and wherever. It's um, what do you call it? You must jammer is the chosen one. You must become a meme lord. Um, there's this one picture where it is. Where is it? Let me look for it. I think it's in my Deviant Art. Definitely not here. Where is it? This is like I'm fiddling on another screen. It's not here. Okay. Uh, here we go. Uh, the heck? Why did it friggin' download the image? Rather than open it up. I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna scan this with antivirus just to make sure. Like, why the heck did you download it rather than just open it? Okay, here we go. Here, this one. I see people post this up all the time, like, uh, <laughs> uh, and whatnot. Which is funny because this is a MLP meme that day. Uh, okay, uh, see ya, Tenen. Thanks for joining. Anyway, uh, this is actually just a redraw of. Uh, of a um what do you call it of a mlp meme where it's like a it's like a my little pony with also that says send nudes my favorite time point of the stream is the jamming time and jammed all over the place yep they everyone got all jammed up yep And then when I took the basketball and I jammed it everywhere. After how long you have been on, on this tangent? Uh, long enough, I guess. Man, it hasn't even been an hour yet. This stream's going so long. <laughs> this is like the part of the artwork that I'm like, I'm bored at just making stuff. Fill in and colors. <laughs> oh, she has shoelaces? Oh, okay, the shoelaces aren't showing here, but they're showing over here. I'll play chess while you're while you do art and then we we can thank them. Space Jam. The people who made English made the word front as a tribute to MD to me. <laughs> who Okay. Otherwise we should have said ventral or dorsal. What? 
Uh, what? Huh? Why did you say that? <laughs> oh, I haven't saved in a while. That definitely should save. I don't think I'll be able to finish this work by the time Pikami uh, graduates. I have, um, I have one week. I have roughly two weeks, less than two weeks left to finish, finish something. I and I doubt that she's gonna like show it on her stream or something, on her last stream or even one of her streams. So I don't know. Should I rush this work or not? But um, I think the the speed I'm going at at I'm gonna finish this puppet in um how many more streams like maybe one more stream for the other leg and then one or two more streams for the arms and then one or two streams for the uh, other head and then two more streams for the mouths at at most two more streams so at least six more streams after this so i think i the model will be finished by the by definitely before the uh before her graduation bye bye whams oh yeah and thanks for joining me front dive uh you have been monitoring your behavior sin pattern since 2012 uh we have been uh, da, 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 ensure safety did that lol maybe yeah i i right now i'm going at a slow pace but uh from my calculation i just did in my head um it is uh i would probably still be able to finish it before before she graduates but then of course i need to do the video but the video I have planned is kind of, um, what do you call it? It's kind of complex. So I'm going to make a simple, simple video of her, um, so that I could just get it out in time. So, so this simple video will, I'll try to get it out before, before she graduates in the in the unlikely hope that she'll feature it she'll react to it on one of her streams which i i doubt but here's hoping why is that shoelace uh weird looking Yeah, hopefully I could do it if I don't like get sick or have to do overtime or whatever. Or hopefully I don't get a, like if I play Tales of Symphonia, hopefully I don't get addicted to it. And then I stopped doing this because I like, ah, oh, I want to play it. I want to stream it again. So I'm going to play it tomorrow instead of doing, doing this, uh, uh, str uh, a thingy. Doing this, uh, model. Oh, I feel like I run out of topics to say. Do, 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 do. 
It's uh, for for some reason I thought this was a bow tie, but it's not. It's a it's a shoelace. I've been staring at for so long. You don't know what I'm looking at. Pitchubo. You know what? Like uh, I was asking my bro uh like about. Like, since his girlfriend became a corporate VTuber, I was like, he said he couldn't tell me, but I still asked him a few questions, like, what she's streaming and whatnot. I'm like, now that I think about it in hindsight, I shouldn't have been asking, and he shouldn't have been answering them. Because <laughs> maybe now I'm like, huh, with this information, I can find out. I can find out! <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, I see a little error over there. I see an error. Then my bro is actually watching. Oh, how dare you. How dare you, bro. How dare you. Jammer is good boy. Jammer wouldn't do that. Jammer is good boy. In one of these days, my my curiosity gets piqued. I mean, I mean, I will try to avoid it as much as I can because you know how the VTubing, how how simps are online. Like they find out. I mean, it's, well, I don't think uh, it's that bad for the American crowd. But for the Japanese crowd, you know, like, uh, the simps will get angry and whatnot. And, and, and all the anti, antis will, like, uh, antis will form because, oh, this virtual lady has a boyfriend? What? I'm simping for this lady who has a great personality. And... I'm shocked somehow that they don't they don't have a boyfriend in real life. Uh, <laughs> uh, I never understood why people want their idols pure and such. Yeah, I mean, especially for VTubing because what you're falling for the the character and not the voice behind it. It's like imagine like you really like Raven from Teen Titans Go and then you're like you find out Tara Strong is married and like no you should not be married Raven is mine <laughs> Raven is my waifu <laughs> You are not allowed to be married Tara Strong you you have to be married. You have to be. You can only be married to me or something like that. <laughs> Timmy Turner. Timmy Turner's voice actor is married. What? <laughs> I imagine it was like that. <laughs> it's like how ridiculous. It, in my mind, that's how ridiculous it is. Like oh. <laughs> Mary in my mind that's how ridiculous it is like oh the vo the the actress for the for the vtuber is like oh they don't want her to be married uh, they don't want her to be have a boyfriend and whatnot <laughs> oh i think i need to make an adjustment because you see here there's this thing here that goes underneath the shoe but sort sort uh because this one's simplified and doesn't have it i see i see i see uh whatever i'll leave it simplified because i'm too late <laughs> i'm feeling too lazy okay one foot is done that's cool one foot one leg i got a leg up on you Oh, shoot. And also, like, um, why don't, like, 
fans get annoyed that like say for me my waifu you know my waifu is um misra right but obviously in the game she has interests for rex and whatnot obviously she has interests in rex like imagine if if i would throw a fit because no misra should not be interested in rex you should be interested in no one so that I have a chance with Misra, you know? <laughs> that's 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 the other thing that I feel that's so ridiculous about, like, wh why do these idols have to be, like, n not to have a boyfriend or whatever, <laughs> right? Oh, uh, what's I doing? Ah, uh, yeah, Torso. <laughs> right? Am, am I right or am I wrong, right? Right, 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 right. Yeah. That's why, like, like for me, it's like it doesn't make any sense. Which is funny because like uh, this character I'm drawing peak of me, she's the only one like uh, where the fans like to joke with her like um, like the fans are like, oh, um, I just want to be friends <laughs> with peak of me. And like th there's this one guy who was like, oh, can we get married peak of me because I, I want work visa to go to Japan. And then later he super chats. Oh, I got a work. Uh, I got work visa to Japan. We don't need to be ma get married anymore. <laughs> uh, like she's the only one where, where they make jokes like that where, oh, I only like peak of me as a friend. And that's why it's so funny. Now she's like. People like people chatting now, like, oh, I love Pikami as my girlfriend, and she has boing boing. <laughs> uh, man, I'm gonna miss Pikami. <laughs> oh, I made myself sad. Anywho, uh, okay, I need to make those shorts. Short, short, shorts. Ah, how fast that is. I love doing that, like just doing that and, and, and I could fill in the color like almost immediately. Uh, excuse me. Oh, I forgot to lock that. Did I not? Hmm, this song is uh, pretty good. That leg looks a little bit too muscular. Sorry, Pikami, you not that muscular. I gotta make make it more feminine, more skinny. Oh yeah, did I ask if you watch Bocce the Rock? Because like I said, I was watching it today, like a few episodes. I'll watch the rest um, later before I go to bed. It's nice, but there is a gap that might never be filled. In Bocce the Rock? Do you... do I like it? Um, It reminds me a lot of uh, Watamote. 
Except Watamote is more comedy. Uh, I mean, they're both comedy, but like Watamote is kind of like cringe stuff. Like, uh, what do you call it? Um, the Office. Or like, uh, especially The Office UK. Like, it's more like cringe comedy. And that's why a lot of uh, Westerners really like Watamote. But meanwhile, like, like I, I heard that it wasn't that popular in Japan. So it never got a season two. It was like really popular in the West because, like I said, the West they have, they have shows with like cringe culture, uh, with cringe comedy, like uh, like I said, like The Office. But yeah, um, what was I saying? Um, uh, like a lot of the the exploits of the characters, a character of Bochi. Oh you no. Know, Bochi's not actually her name. That's her band name, right? Um, a lot of the, the the trial she goes to is very trivial. And, and obviously in the grand scheme of things, it's like, you know, you're worrying too much and all that. But you, you, it, like seeing the character go through like, um, like her personal uh, stuff like that it, it, and whatnot... It really makes you root for her and that's why I find it like really like it's like it's it's the stuff is very like I said it's very um low stakes and whatnot and very trivial like definitely like like not like an action kind of anime and whatnot or grand schemes but they develop the character so well that you know you uh and and whatnot uh, that you want to root for her even though it's like very trivial and stuff and uh, you know like uh, it's pretty good uh, like that anxiety is a joke jammer. Uh, I like her a lot better than Komi like uh, in Komi can't communicate because Komi is a little bit sh She's she's like Mary Sue because like she's the complete opposite of Watamote and um and Bochi where nobody um nobody uh notices them and whatnot. Meanwhile in like Komi can communicate it's like oh like everyone just loves her for some reason but she just can't get the grip to talk to people. Uh they're I feel like Komi can't communicate the 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 strength in it is the additional characters rather than Komi herself. So you know, all these other characters commun uh, and stuff. But Komi does also does that thing, like I said, where um you you do want to root for her and you want to see her get her goal and whatnot. Same with Bochi, like she also wants to make friends and whatnot. And yeah, and I definitely felt like 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 that. Like especially when I was living in Dubai after college, where I where I was unemployed and I basically had no job and like no friends and whatnot. And and I I definitely felt that way. Like how Bochi feels. Like oh, my life is terrible. Uh terrible even if i don't like it, it would be it would be fine if i didn't have a job if i had friends to hang out with but i didn't so it, it's like an extra dagger in the heart you know side cast carries once again in what in uh in Komi. But yeah, I mean, uh, they're both good shows for different reasons. But yeah, um, so far, um, I was hoping that would, there'd be more music in uh, Bochi the Rock. I was like thinking it would be like, uh, what are, are, what's, are some of the anime that the side cast saves the show? Um, I guess something like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, like... Um, like 
part one of JoJo, like I really don't like <laughs> um, Jonathan Joestar, and uh, I feel like the uh, what do you call it? Um, Oreo Speed Wagon and uh, other characters. Uh, Zeppeli, what was his name? Like they, they are far more interesting than than Jonathan, which is like the exact opposite of uh, of part two because I friggin' love Joseph Joestar. What do you mean he's the best Joe, bro? Speed Wagon is a god, yeah. And then um. What do you call it? Uh, um, I, I like Jotaro, but uh, he's fine. But like, I I, I like Polnareff like better, and I like um, Iggy and uh, all those other guys better. Avdol, which is funny because is his name really pronounced Avdol because. I would think it was pronounced Abdul, because <laughs> you know, like uh, Arabic and stuff like it would be Abdul instead of Avdol. <laughs> Too stoic for you, Jammer? I guess. J Joe Troy is a fanboy. Clint Eastwood fanboy, I guess. Uh, you know, instead of doing the sock, I think I'll just steal the, the sock from over there and put it over here. Rich Jammer stealing socks. Smaller. Rich Jammer stealing people's socks. Stop that, please. No dignity. Um, I think I should get rid of that for a sec so I can see. Mm, I need to get rid of the other leg for a sec. Bye bye, other leg. What is it saying? Other shows where the side characters uh, save it or are better than the main character. I mean, honestly, a ton of shows or movies are like that because typically you want the uh, the main character to be like the goody two shoes because he's got to be the level headed one uh, or whatever to save the day. Like, like for instance, Star Wars. Like, I, I guess, like Luke Skywalker is, uh, he becomes an interesting character. But I, I honestly think he's like the most boring of uh, like all of them. Like Han, like Han is more interesting. Princess Leia is more interesting. Chewbacca is more interesting. Obi Wan is more interesting. And Luke is like the least interesting of all of them. Just some random farm boy. You have watched Lesson in Meme Culture is a it's nice look. Lesson in Meme. I think I've I've seen a video of them or it sounds familiar. What was it, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um Of course he's a uh, POV character. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. That's the thing, like, uh, if, if you're, if you're in, if, that's the thing in a lot of TV shows and whatnot, the POV character is 
the more most down to earth character who is um, the most relatable to the audience, or or something like that. Um, meanwhile, everything else is weird, so that while while that character is uh, reacting to everything, the audience is also reacting. Like, oh, this thing is weird. Oh, isn't it weird? And the character is reacting and like, just like the audience. Like, oh, that's weird. <laughs> right? Whatever weird thing the, the main character sees, it's the odd. It's like, uh, it's a surrogate for the audience to see that weird thing. Yeah. That's why a lot of, uh, that's why a lot of RPGs uh you're 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 like a kid in that's why a lot of rpgs you know you're like a kid in a small town and then some giant thing happens and then you have to go out and uh, ex uh discover the world for yourself probably only a very few uh rpgs don't do it that way like final fantasy final fantasy 7 is one like cloud is sort of like an established character already You know what, let's make this one. Like YouTubers trying to make a cult in his Discord ecocentric to the max. Uh. What's I doing again? Uh. Oh yeah, I just like watching a bunch of YouTubers and stuff, and they always use this term, um, like, I don't disagree, and then I remember I, I sent them a chat, like, asking, like, what does, what what's the difference between I agree and I don't disagree? Because, you know, it's like d double negatives. Um, so they explained, like, um, what do you call it? Um, number one, it's mostly for comedic value. Like, oh, I don't disagree. It's basically saying like, oh, what you're saying is not wrong, or I don't. I it it's not wrong, or I don't. I'm not going to say it's. I don't disagree with it, but I'm not going to outright agree with it because you know I might get in trouble or something. It's like like uh, it's like uh, saying like oh you said a a fact that sounds very um, disagreeable, but you know like oh you said it but I don't disagree. You're correct, but I'm not gonna say it myself. Kind of like that. Like YouTuber trying to make uh, okay socks and feet jammer, but it looks like you're running out of steam. <laughs> Future proofing, I guess. Maybe I'm running out of steam. What? Do I sound tired? Oof, why does it look like that? No. Do I sound tired? You think I should stop? When I met my brother yesterday, he was like, Do you have a cold? You sound like you've got a cold. And I was like, um, uh, I've had a stuffy nose for a while. Uh, no, I don't have a cold. Anyway, what you're saying there? Go, Jammer, go. Well, it's up to you. Why does this shoe look wrong? I mean, it looks like the shoe over there. Kind of. Blocked organs can affect people's voice, really. Is the nose considered an organ? 
I guess like an instrument organ. <laughs> Like a musical organ. Did, could you hear? Could the mic pick that up? Because I had uh, what's it called turned on. Is it real imperfection or imagine? I don't know. Well, how you constipated your voice will be different. <laughs> I guess it'll be different because you'll be going like this. Uh, 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 I'm constipated. Like a recorder. Oh yeah, like it. I guess that's where I was going. Like, oh, it's like, uh, uh or musical organ. Yeah. Does it actually look like that? Kind of. Oh yeah, I was like uh, talking to some people in a, in a TFH community, and I was like, they they were talking about like uh, complaints about the game and all that, and I brought up that I had like for a long time I'm like kind of mad that um, I'm not getting my uh, backer stuff. And they're like telling me, oh, you know, you should go on Twitter and, um, and like tag, uh, like, like one of my tiers is, uh, what do you call it? I'm supposed to get a doodle from Lauren Faust and stuff. They're like, you know, you, you should pr try, they're like, oh, you should try, uh, tweeting at Lauren Faust because maybe you might be able to get it or something like that. And I'm like, I don't have a tw <laughs> Twitter. And, uh, and I'm like wondering, huh, am I missing stuff by not being on Twitter? Like I can't... Because like for some reason nowadays like customer service, well in the US, like I don't have issues with customer service here in Philippines, but the US you want like customer service, you want stuff done. A lot of times you have to resort to shaming companies on Twitter and, and stuff. You passed the vibe check. Twitter is cringe. <laughs> uh, I, I used to have a Twitter mostly because, um, you know, I wanted. Because you know my video formats and my art and stuff, right? So, uh, like my video formats, they're all shorts and stuff. So I wanted to post my videos on Twitter so that people can share them around. Because it, it, my videos are short and they're more, they feel like they're more compatible with the short format of Twitter and where people can share them around. And I was like, eh, this place kind of sucks. So yeah, so I left. But now I'm like wondering, huh? Because there are, there's been a few times where it's like, oh, this YouTuber, YouTube, uh, this YouTuber said, oh, uh, you could contact me about like stories or whatever or issues you've had on Twitter. I'm like, oh, I don't have a Twitter. Yeah, that's not a good system. Yeah. What is this? Huh? Ah. Maybe, but Twitter is a big cesspool right now. Best ways to stop, stay off for a while. It's been a... It used to be cool back like in 2014 or something. And then it became terrible. I used to think it was like really lame because I remember like... Um, I think it was during the um, Obama election um with against Hillary Clinton 
and a whole bunch of these um what do you call them a whole bunch of the uh politicians they were like while they're in congress and stuff they're all live tweeting and i used to view it as oh it's just some like it's an old people platform for politicians to uh whatever Cause yeah, that's how it was back then. Like I remember, like people on, like pol American politicians on their phones, like, um, what do you call it? But then yeah, it changed. MySpace used to be cool. I never actually had a MySpace account. I had Friendster account. <laughs> uh, did MySpace come first? I think MySpace was popular in America, but not in like Dubai and Philippines. It was Friendster. And after that, everyone just went to Facebook. Man, I, I still had a Friendster account when I was in college. Like 2000. 8 2007 and stuff and did you hear about the uk politician that got caught watching porn at a meeting um on his phone or on the computer and his excuse was he was looking up tractors and the corn popped up <laughs> man he's, he's 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 just taking the the piss out of you oh the corn popped up this sounds like a joke phone okay <laughs> <laughs> the corn popped up. <laughs> uh. He was interested in plowing. <laughs> oh, wow. That was a good one. <laughs> I see a mistake right there. Right where? Oh, yeah. Mistake there there was one over there. Right there right here. Right now. Right here. Right now. You ever listen to uh Fat Boy Slim? I used to really like him. Now I'm like, eh, they're okay, I guess. There was this like one fat boy slim song that I swear was in the Matrix, but uh Oh, like Matrix OST, but then I remember I keep listening to the Matrix OST and it's like, nope, it's not here, it's not there, it's not anywhere. I must have like imagined it or something. I guess it just sounded a lot like, like it could belong in the Matrix uh, OST that I imagined it. Right here, right now, right here, right now. What else songs? <laughs> That's all I remember right now. A jammer, try searching up a parody of the Let the Bodies Hit the Floor. I can only count to four. Is it on YouTube? Man, so many videos back then, like, uh, um use that song especially all those um what do you call it on new grounds and all those stick man animations i think they were all on new grounds but i always went to other websites to watch them like stick man 
Uh, there's some website called Stickman something. I forgot like action or movies or all that. And I watch all the Stickman Flash videos there. What did you say? Um, let the body sit to four. I can only count to four. Oh, is this it? Um, Muppets? I'm going to mute the audio just in case, like, I don't want to get copyright. I can only count to four. 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 Oops, I'm stupid. I muted myself and not the, <laughs> and not the video. Ah, oh, wow. Well, you heard the song. Hopefully it wasn't that long to get uh, copyright struck. Uh, I'll watch this later. I'll, I'll put it on my likes. Let the, the body hit the floor. Classic one. <laughs> Wah, ja, wah, jammer, whammer, go, jammer goes wah, that's why he's whammer. Wah, 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 wah. Okay, there we go. I guess I could finish this leg. Should I do one of the arms? Oh, uh, oh wait, no, I'll definitely only finish one leg today. I'll finish the other one tomorrow. I mean, no, both legs are done. Finish the arms tomorrow. Oh, not tomorrow. Tomorrow is Siberia. Oh, that's right. I'm still doing Siberia streams. I didn't it count that in the equation that I did earlier. Oh, I have seven days, so I have like a week. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I only have six section uh, sessions left of this before <laughs> Pikami graduates. Siberia can wait. Oh, yeah, you're right. You know, uh, uh, I th yeah, I'll continue this tomorrow. That's the thing I wanted to... So that I don't get, um... What do you call it? I don't get fatigued by doing this, uh, like, every day. So... But, yeah, like, I, I think I'm, I'm getting more fatigued playing Siberia <laughs> than, than doing this. It's like, obviously, I mean, I am getting fatigued of doing this. Like, right now, this is the boring part. Like, you know, just, it's, I'm just coloring, coloring it in. It's not like it's going, what do you mean? Like, Pika me is going. Pika me is leaving. Oh, I forgot to put that. But then, why am I doing- why am I in such a hurry? Because of the faint hope that Pikami might friggin' react to my uh, f stupid uh, animation or my drawing. <laughs> I doubt it. And watch as she actually does. <laughs> I still doubt it. Because like, how many other people are doing stuff? And plus, I'm not engaging with the community. It's not like I'm in the Discord or on Twitter and like tell, telling people, Oh, look, I'm doing this, I'm doing that.
camera, matching a long haired girl that has dyed hair on the inside but black hair on the outside. What? Dyed hair. What? Dyed hair on the in. What? Inside of. How does. How does. Oh, you're, I guess you're right. Yeah, see? The hair in the back is dyed and the outside it's normal. Oh yeah, one thing about Pikami is like, um, he's like a half Japanese, right? And, uh, what do you call it? Um, she has blonde hair, but then, you know, Japan, you, obviously, you know, Asians have all black hair. But she looks Japanese and she has blonde hair. So, you know, like... The teachers in her school were like, no, you're not allowed to have dyed hair. And he said, like, no, it's natural. This is my hair. Now, that's, what, that's what makes it extra frustrating and sad. To speak of me, she was like, uh, she was an outcast for so long. And she finally found, like, this community that uh that you know that she can engage with and all that <laughs> and she's like very not confrontational she she's like bochi she she's basically like bochi the rock like um she she's really talented like in music i mean bochi is like really talented in music and um and uh, what do you call it and she, she finally found the thing like where she can you know have fun and uh be popular and whatnot and, and it's like it's like peak of me like oh like her bubbly like, like it's like 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 that like it's like pochi the rock but you know some schools for students to dye hair black do they um what do you call it? Do they reimburse them for like oh the for the fees? <laughs> I think this thing needs to be thicker. Oh, it's this one. I think it's generally a required what? Oh, that so that you can even enter to have dyed hair in Japan. Well, they they didn't force her to dye her hair black, so I guess it wasn't a requirement at her school at least. I think most parents would be happy to pay for it. Okay, I guess. I mean, to be fair, I don't know the school system and I don't know that much about Japanese culture. I'm not that much a weeb. Weeb. Weeaboo. Weeaboo. You know the, the uh, what do you call it? The origin of the term weeaboo? Um, dyed black to force uniformity. But like I said, like, uh, they told her that uh, she's not allowed to have dyed hair, but um, her hair was. They she was allowed to keep her hair blonde. What? Oh, the origin of Weeaboo. Um, what do you call it? Like, there's this comic where um, it's like a web comic. It's just some random web comic where there. It's like a, in an office setting or something, and there, all these employees. They're kind of like bullying one of them or not really bullying they're you know the whole like bro or office culture or whatever where they're like chanting so they i think they lift the guy up on a chair and they just keep saying we uh boo we uh boo we uh boo something like that 
and that's like the first instance and and, and someone used it somewhere I, I forget maybe you could find it on uh know your meme or something i don't know but i i, I just remember seeing like ooh, oh this is uh, the origin of the term weeaboo I remember back then I didn't I kinda disliked my older brother because he was a um well the the term weeaboo didn't exist back then so I was just like Japanophile. The <laughs> back when I hated anime. Anime is stupid. Anime is stupid and you're stupid for liking it. <laughs> What about a Westaboo? Yeah, um, what do you call it? Hideo Kojima is, is basically a Westaboo. A lot of people in Konami, I think, were Westaboos because, like, you look at the old box art for Contra. It's basically just Sylvester Stallone and um, and uh, who's the other guy? Um, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Anime stupid lol. Yeah, I I remember like I really disliked anime and most of the reasons why I said I didn't like it, I figure out later on it's it's the um it's the what do you call it? It's the genre of anime of uh what do you call that again? Um Shonen, like, um, I basically just didn't really like Shonen <laughs> anime. Because all, all the complaints I was making can be, uh, can be levied to Shonen anime. Oh, I didn't do the leg, uh... Always what I was saying, like shonen anime. Um, but there are some issues that uh, are not just for shonen anime and manga that that <laughs> are in um, other anime, even ones that I like. Like um, they always break uh, major a lot of them. They break the rule of you know don't show, don't tell. And like I, I, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure is like one is one of the biggest culprits of this. Um, like, like one of the scenes I I, I, I really like to um, that I point out in my head. Um, it's mostly from the weakness that it's too faithful, faithful to the manga. So Jammer, could you do something shorter if you were burned out then get back to this art project like a Minesweeper or learning music placement? Uh, music placements would be like something long. That's the thing is Siberia was supposed to be a short game. It's like, you know, it's like a couple, uh, like, I don't know, 10 hours long, but it feels like it's longer and I'm getting frustrated with it. So yeah, <laughs> there's that. I think, is this knee too long? Or does it look fine? I mean, to be fair, her her leg is more angled this way. So her knee would be sharper than this one, which is more angled forward. So I think it's fine. It it's actually might be a little bit big. I think it might be needs to be a little bit smaller. Oh, 
Oh, Siberia is a monster. An undead brought back to life. Yeah. I was hoping it was sh gonna be shorter, but like, it, it's not short enough. <laughs> uh, so what game do I have in my list that is uh, pretty short? Oh, I forgot to put the shadows on the shoe, uh, on the socks. That's the thing. Unfortunately, a lot I've been avoiding or or whatever. A lot of the longer games. So a lot of the games on my list are long. Long as fuck. Oh yeah, over here. Do do do. Oh yeah, I should bring out the list, I guess, so that I can see what short games I could do instead of Siberia. Then I could do Siberia after. Uh, wait, let me lock those. I'll save it real quick. Uh, okay, where's the list? Where? Where? I thought I opened the list. Okay, there it is. What? What's a short game here? NBA 2K23? Maybe I could just do the beginning of the campaign? I don't know. PlayStation Move Heroes? That's kind of a... It's on PS3, so I have to set up the... <laughs> I have to set up the console and I have to set up the camera and all that, so it's more of a pain to set up. Uh, Psychonauts, dude. Spec Up the Line is like a five to six hour game. It's, uh, uh, it's kind of long. Republic Commando. Okay, all of these are long. Maybe I could have a session where I play Dirt 3. Um, where I continue where I was, what I was doing. Right? I could continue it and then I, I could just go back and play it like in the future or something. Could be one of my um, games that I play every now and uh, for fun or something every now and then. Yeah, dirt. Um, yeah, when I when I feel when I'm feeling burnt out, I guess I'll do that. But so I mean, hmm, well, right now I feel burnt out because, like I said, I I went to the gym and uh, tired and all that, and didn't have a nap. But then, of course, I can't sleep either, so might as well stream. Might as well stream. left leg you deaf should So after this, I'm going to continue watching some Bocce the Rock and uh, drink some alcohol to help me sleep. <laughs> Man, like I remember during the pandemic, I drank so much alcohol during the night to, to, to help with my insomnia. It's not like I was addicted or anything. It was just like I just couldn't sleep. 
not I'm, it's not like I'm addicted to alcohol. I just couldn't sleep. Def, uh, uh, Jammer, the alcoholic sounds like a Sonic character. <laughs> Jammer, the alcoholic. So I, I was worried that I was becoming like, uh, what do you call it? Unintentionally becoming an alcoholic. This shoelace looks too small. I think I need to make it bigger. Because look how big this looks. Uh... Uh, right leg, right leg, left leg. Or would you be rich, the jammer, or jammer the rich? Um, the naming convention in Sonic is uh, blank the blank, right? So it'd be rich the jammer. We could be no, uh, hmm. Cause it have to be something like uh, you know, like you had Fang the sniper, and and obviously you have animals like armadillo and whatnot. I think Amy Rose and uh, Amy Rose and Miles Tails Frower are the only uh, ones who don't fall under this, besides Doctor Eggman, like Robotnik the Eggman. Imagine. That's what his name, if that, if his name became that. <laughs> but yeah, um. Is there anything other character that sounds like, uh, that is, um, not an animal, like Fang the Sniper? Tails the Fox. No, they don't call him Tails the Fox, they call him Miles Tails Prower. His name is. Miles Tails Brower Blaze the Cat Amy the Hedgehog I think originally in, in Japan he was called Miles Brower because it's a pun Miles Per Hour but then uh, US, the US branch was like, you know, he's got tails. Let's make fun of him and call him Tails. <laughs> nah, just kidding. But yeah, they're like, let's give him the nickname Tails. Yahoo, Yahoo. Just a little bit bigger. There we go. There we go, both legs done. Oh, can't wait to finish the arm so I could uh, test out the body. Cause like, what the fudge? It's like uh, taking so long. Oh, underneath her legs, uh, there's a shadow. Okay, I, I need to put that. Or else it'll look weird without any color. Oh, I already reached two hours, but yeah, I still gotta finish this leg. There we go. Okay, and then this leg. This song is pretty good. Bah. 
Baya do, baya do. Oh, you ever, um, you ever see a video or play the game The Herbs, which is just The Sims in the city? And, uh, you got like, um, art, musical artists like Black Eyed Peas in it. And then you have like famous Black Eyed Peas songs sung in uh, Simlish. And it's like, oh wow, <laughs> it's in Simlish. Any other shadows I need to make? I think that's it. Oh, I need the shadow from the t-shirt. So... Okay. Shadow of the t-shirt. Can I cut it? Uh, can I just use the knife? I know the leg is gonna move, but whatever. What? Screw it. Chaba chaba maleyo, chaba maleyo. Chama chama maleyo, chama chama maleyo. Uh, I've seen the commercial. Oh, so <laughs> MPH. Did you know, Jammer, if you state the information so blatantly wrong, someone will correct you. You don't need to search. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Jammer, did you read Archie a comic, Fleetway, IDW? I didn't read RD RDW, but uh, I did the... Uh, man, like... Uh, me and my bro, we have my older bro. We have a long history with the Archie comics thing. Um, what do you call it? Um, like me and my bro, we like Sonic the Hedgehog before the game. Uh, I mean, before we ever played the game, because there's a TV show for it, and I remember we made some drawings for it. But, um, well, when the show ended, we, we obviously, uh, we didn't pay much mind to it. But then, like, um, like, I think the first Archie com, uh, Sonic Archie comic that my brother ever bought was in, was in the airport. Because, like, my uncle, he would always go, uh, he'd always go on business trips and my mom... Uh, like we would always like meet him in the airport and and stuff so we'd go to the airport a lot and you know in the place that we waited it was a duty-free um like supermarket or something uh, not supermarket like a mini mart and they sold comics like and then on it was you know sonic the hedgehog and it was the um it was the arc where Sonic was a fugitive, so it was like Sonic the Fugitive uh, 1. And it was like part 3, no, it was part 2 of 4. And uh, and part 4 was the 50th, uh, was the 50th um, a comic. So yeah, like, and, and from that on we became like Super Sonic, uh, we became Sonic fans, like, before that, the only time that I actually played the game was at like some kid's birthday party and they had uh, a Sega Genesis on just out uh, that you can play. So I remember like playing it and all that. But yeah, uh, 
But yeah, I, I I did read the the Sonic, uh, the Archie comics. I've seen the comics. Seemed restrictive though. Ah, uh, Mephiles. This is name again. Mephiles. Mephiles is in Sonic 06, right? Also, why is the shoe like this? Meanwhile, here it's up on top. I think I, I'm going to edit this to look different, but oh, whatever. I'll leave it for now. Like, don't just finish it and then uh, like fix the details later. But yeah, there we go. It actually looks significantly better than I thought it would. It looks it looks pretty neato. Right? It looks it looks pretty good. I was so worried that it would, would not look good, but look like the shirt and the legs. The shoes look a bit wonky. Um this especially this shoe, but this shoe looks fine. So I'm fine with that. But this one looks wonky, but this one looks fine. But yeah. Um it looks a lot better than I was expecting. I was so I said this last time, but I'm gonna say it again. I I was so worried that it's gonna look weird. Now now the arms. The biggest challenge is the arms, because like I said, if the arms, when the arms go above the shoulders, especially with her model, like it's always gonna look weird. So, like, I would have to make separate arms for her. Like, I, I would have to make a separate asset where her arms are up like this. Just so that um, it doesn't look weird. <laughs> if it, it uh, if she lifts up her arms. How about this? Oh. I mean, that's how a leg kind of looks like from the side. But maybe it doesn't look that great. Uh, it's fine, I guess. You know what? Uh, it doesn't look great. I will edit it real quick. back here <laughs> and yeah okay oh yeah color color test to see if any colors have bled out it looks fine this knee looks too sharp um i guess it's fine because like i said the knee is a little bit uh is is more to the side than this one which is more to the um front and hopefully no one no looks at the legs because mostly um especially you know a stuff it'll be just mostly the torso and up my animation oh uh, my animation her legs might actually be covered uh, so i think it's not that big of an issue anywho oh yeah i am so happy with how it looks i'm i mean the arms aren't out but so far like i i, mean, I guess i'm gonna wait for the arms to show and it was like oh no this looks terrible oh do i need to put a shadow underneath um do I need to put a shadow under her uh, thing? Yeah, there is a shadow. So that's gonna be issue when when her head moves around. Should I add the ass shadow now? Because the uh, what do you call it? The hair does not um like the shadow does not move along with the hair. Or maybe I could do that. Maybe not. Will it be seen? Ah, uh, wait. I got an idea for the hair. Um, okay. Head. Okay, base.
So these banks, I won't do anything, but this one I will. Um, let me get the color first. Bald, bald. No, just kidding. Uh, base. Yeah, here we go. There we go. That looks good. Now I hear you ask, what about the um the the bangs? These bangs, I can't really do anything about it. Like the shadows doing the shadows to the face is a little bit too complex but for this one uh i can do something so i'm going to take this color out and i'm going to make it bigger like this like this and then i'm going to do this Ta -da! now most of the work is it's it's gonna be part of the uh what do you call it it's gonna be part of the model as it moves around what the heck is this music it might need to be a little bit darker so let's make it 20% no I think 20% is too much 15% there we go so now so now the shad like when the bangs move around the shadow is also gonna move around on her face so yeah that'd be cool but unfortunately for these ones I can't do it the same because it would uh, go out outside the thing. Maybe if I used clipping, uh, a clipping mask, it would be fine. But I don't know how to do that. So yeah. Yeah, anywho. Yeah, boy. Looking good, Pika me. Looking good. I am satisfied. Anywho, that's it for today's stream. I'm gonna go watch a few episodes of Bocce the Rock uh, before going to bed. Thanks for joining me, Will. See you tomorrow for more Pika Me uh, thing. And then maybe day after tomorrow I'm to take a break, I might do the um, Siberia stream, but I don't know. Uh, maybe I'll just continue doing this. It depends on how far I get with the arms. I could do the arms tomorrow and then I could get the basic rigging of the puppet done. And then uh then I could uh, I'll, I'll take a break like as a reward. But yeah. That's it and see you tomorrow. Bye for now.